green from right to left. Oh, it stayed high on it and fooled us both. That was to tie for the lead for Kant. Wind off the left for Henselite. Into eight. The face slightly open, the wind exaggerated that. from here so like it was interesting to see the uh, the way they react to sort of post olympics esther i think mainly encouraged by edge of the green sending this six iron high into the sky and all over the pin show it and be like you do know who i am don't you gold medal access oh try to stay in that one didn't Straight back into the wind, this seventh hole, and Kang Nu below the green, opting to chip it, try and take some slope out. I was going to go downhill. Oh, that's incredible. Wow. I thought that was difficult, Megan. Spy, maybe, playing alongside the captain. Birdie put here on eight for Lydia Ko. From 160 yards, left herself this 12-footer. Struck with authority into the heart. Of the day. Esther Henselite. Trying to give herself another birdie look. And does. In fact, you would say... Light. Three birdies in the last four holes. A fine way to end. To walk through that guard of honour. To stand on the podium. To left and be slightly downhill here to stay at minus one. That is some save right off. Go from Nassian out to four or five feet. She knows her numbers and she can hit them. For it to go, it listened. Worst of the weather, but she's fought back since the sun's come out. I think all in all, she'll be fairly satisfied with a 74, given where she was at five over par. You're right, she was fine. We we'll mentioned Hyoju Kim earlier, second last year. This is her opening hole, the par four tenth. For a three. In a share of the lead for now, Lydia Ko over par. Four wins in the last year on the LET for her. 138 yards into eight. 837. Looks like Leanne Pace from the left hand side here on seven. Going Gary Player esque South African style, all black the top of the leaderboard playing alongside pace and first in imagine if she holds it <laughs> you hit it close but I've made a three from long range well now the pressure's on for the other two isn't it below the hole on now. Yeah, late starter to the uh, lovely birdie from Firstling. Gets herself to one over par. Yeah, she got that one just right. Left of that, you don't want to land it on it. Inside 100.
That's good caddy in there from Tanya Pack. This ninth hole, par four, is a birdie opportunity. Should be driver wedge for these players. We want three and a half point in that team. Yeah, I just wish that one, didn't she? First birdie of the round comes at the final hole. Well, nearly eight hours after they were due to start, they have finished this three bolt lane. Fairly close from the American. From 100 yards. Great angle. So matches Lydia Coe's round of 69, Megan Kang. But the sun had popped out and she started making birdies. She went out in level part and had five pars in a row. A birdie two here on the sixth. That got her to under par for the day. Yeah, you let me know who uh, has just birdied the third, fourth and fifth holes. Here she is at six for another. was a runner-up a couple of years ago and Evian was in the Solheim Cup. Pick trousers on. They're the waterproof ones, aren't they? Oh, yeah. Kejin Choi. So second into nine. Wedge in the hand. Funnel pin as well. Here's Lexi first in. in. Not flapping around too much right now, the flag. Not bothering Charlie Hull right in the middle. Nice start. Evian, 81 she started. She must be aware of that as well and thinking, need to stop doing that. It's hard to win when you're shooting those numbers, day one. Lovely start from Paul Arito. It's not, I mean, it's there's a wind, but there's not. I mean, bear in mind, Western Gales is next door, and I always say, well, yeah, obviously, because it is a gale. It's just not what it should be at Dundonald Links today. Come on, who's... That is an outrageous drive by Emily Pedersen. Unfortunately, that okay. No, I, I, I can see the why you'd say that. Nice birdie to finish there for Choi. Gets her under par for the Kang. Front left pin, there is a false front, so you need to carry it all the way into 16. And sticks it right there. This was a green which was so hard to hit last year, but because from Europe. Can't pick Steph Kiriakou though. <laughs> Her first events. Par birdie start from Charlie Hull. Now at the par five, third hole. And home in two. What a shot this is. Three wood there. Setting up a birdie chance. That is a couple of cups from left to right here for Kim. Went sideways at the end. Just the one win, which was that major, the US Open, but had to get three under through three holes. Maybe the speed just kept that one high. As I mentioned, a stroke average of 73.3 in her opening rounds. It affected her shoulder as well. She had some physio actually out of the course yesterday for her back which was part of the same problem, she said, but no problem in terms of the way she... Richard. Tell you what, I wouldn't mind. Oh! 
Well, that's one way of stopping it. What a lucky break that is. On 20, this is a good 45-yard bunker shot from a wet bunker. Well, there's always... really get much worse Just clawed it back a little bit having turned in eight over <laughs> okay she's given herself a chance now had over three hours of delays today coming towards the end of her round is a Lim Kim that should kick in oh well, look at for the outright lead for Aileen Kim. On the 17th hole, put for a birdie three. Oh, look at the wind catch that one. Maybe that breezy bird cut of rough here for Minji Lee. Tried to stun it into the fringe and made a half-decent job of it. A lot simpler shot here for you, and she's more green height. Shift him back into the wind. <laughs> Nobody makes more birdies. Charlie Holt. No, this par five has been pushed back and it's into the wind. Oh. The wedge is pretty close though. How many players find themselves in? Up on the green, Lauren Coglin. Who uh, actually has gone down as a six that she made on the previous par five. We thought it was a par she'd made, so she's one over. Nice tee shot at six from Kiriaku. This is for the two. And I just wonder, you know, go on, you were going to say? Steph Kiriaku. Minji Lee, Australian. Yeah, they're no good in wind. One's grew up in Perth. Min that plays like Charlie Hall, middle of England, just doesn't have that. Jin Yun Ko off the mark, one under. Had a four on the sixth. The fifth, sorry. That is actually the fifth hole, par five. is going to go high from right to left. She coped well with the slopes at Evian. <laughs> Majestic. Fantastic from food away once more. Pop to the par 5 18th. Aileen Kim looking for one more birdie to try and claim the clubhouse lead. Well, that was sensible. You know, you close with a 66 last year, still with a kiss and a yeah, the Yaka food away with the simplest of birdies after that sumptuous approach. on Ooh, boxes one on seven catching up again with Charlie Hull just took a bubble didn't it about four or five feet out to get a little hop speeds around that 150 miles an hour for Charlie Hall and a dog a month ago when the uh, Dana open and 
youngest winner on tour this year, 20 years of age. A putt to get within two. Look out. Angie Lee with a birdie on six gets herself to minus two. Ecologist. Well, there's a surprise. Expecting that one to drop. Pace is key here for Holt. Well negotiated there. Lynn Grant, see if she can maintain this hot run she's on. Wedge into six. Every chance. Every chance. She'll be in Virginia. Doing this, no doubt. Well, it's her home state, isn't it? She lives about an hour away from... ...to them what she wants. Uh, at eight, Shanati Wanaseyan. Two phenomenal shots into eight there. She said it might not have made a difference. To the to the overall result, but she just said, "I wish I'd have played it differently, just to force the issue with Caroline." Because so Caroline, hard, though, isn't it? When a player like that's charging and you know, steamrolling birdie after birdie. Oh. Nearly. And she made her birdie as well. Bounced back to get to two under. Seen some lovely shots, haven't we, coming in from Agat Sozon. And that one got a skip off the front of the green. I think a minimum of three spots for that as well. This one also down the left-hand side, asking the wind to hit it. Oh, that's left. Close. A wiggly one, this one back down the slope for Charlie Holt. Apologies oh, yeah. for the language of uh, young Miss Hull. I uh, can understand why that didn't drop. Like for food away. That is wonderful. And uh, good to get within one shot of the lead. Oh, again, she lips out. Let's go out at three on the part. Special K is enjoying it here in Scotland. 